up with Pale Platoon. And you guys should just... But I'm, I'm already on one of the teams. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm already on the Brown Battalion. <laughs> Dude, what is he doing? He's dancing. What is... Wait, Birdman is doing a mating dance. <laughs> Bird... <laughs> he must become Birdladon. Dude, that's so good. That is so Dude, good. He has a pretty godlike turnaround. Have you seen Yoshi's Crawl? It's no. disgusting. He's is like, it? yeah. He's like, oh, gross. <laughs> it's great. Oh, are you playing? Okay. Uh, yeah, we're ready. Oh, wait, wait. Are we ready? I have no clue. I just said yes. I think we're ready. I don't know. Go play. Yeah, I know. Is I know sis. <laughs> isn't Gnosis one of those really good 64 players? He's one of the better 64 players out here. JV's supposed to body him or something in 64. And I'm, I'm clueless. He plays uh, a mean Kirby. Okay. Which is a bad matchup. Oh. Yeah. So also Kirby's like the easiest character in that game, so it's not it's not that hard to be. Which to is be why Kirby. I'm gonna try to play that character. Yeah. <laughs> I I play Kirby in 64 and Yoshi. Mm -hmm. All right. So we have Seth Lon, the hypest man of all of PM. Oh, Max. AKA Umbreon said, tell Hamlin he's playing like a total dirt bag and then I'm proud of him. Aww, <laughs> I love you too, Umbreon. Uh, yo, Captain Youngblood and shit. Yo, what's good, homie? Why Captain aren't you here? Okay, let's call into the match. Please. No, please. No. All right. Okay. So this is famously one of Roy's worst matchups. Oh, like, yeah? Like, Yoshi is the worst, probably. Followed by DD and DK are tied, followed by other kind of But why is that? I mean you have you have a big bird. Shield grab. Ah. Shield I mean notice big heavy characters are the hardest for Roy. Because they have like big, stupid, huge grabs and like all of Roy's moves are supposed to reach just out of range of most grabs. Which is why you're seeing Sethlon kind of not going for his ham hawks mode you guys know him. Right. Anymore. He's trying to play those footsies really efficiently. He's super scared to hit a shield. This is the equivalent of, okay, so for y'all that don't know, this is the equivalent of playing against Sandy with Street Fighter. You don't want to get grabbed, because then you get hurt. Yeah, so so one, QDD grabs you when you die, and two, he has the biggest grab range in the game. Whoa, really? Er, I think he does. I think QDD has the biggest one. It was That's DK and 3.0, and then now it's... Now it's DDD. Okay. Well, that doesn't really go well, considering that he grabs you, bears you off, uh, grabs you back throws you, and bears you off stage. Yeah, and you're done. He has like one of the best back throws in the game, and then he, then he goes. In. I don't understand why people just don't camp that more and just wait, and then wait at the edge. They're forced to approach. If, if it's a swordsman, they have to approach you. Well, well, optimal dignity is pretty campy, just in general. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. just chill, and then do dumb stuff. Ooh, that was so fast. Came out so quick. Like, okay. But these moments, these strings that you're seeing Sethon get confident. Oh, uh, up throw, up tilt didn't work. That's right. All right, yeah. Up throw, up tilt. Yeah, it should have worked. Wait, he's a fatty and a fast faller, though. On the way up, he's kind of floaty, but on the way down, he's a fast faller. So it's, it's, he's kind of both. He's it's, a hybrid. Yeah. That's weird. He's just a hybrid of weights and characters and options. He's disgusting. Ooh. Ooh that was nice. Got that shield poke. Can we? I just want someone to play Charizard. Can you be a Charizard main now? I I had a Charizard 2.0. Really? Yeah. But everyone. Charizard's a lot of fun. Everyone was broke. Yeah. Free. Right that. now, Charizard's pretty hard and bad. Why? Because he's just a bit too slow for the meta, and he doesn't have the same amazing guaranteed follow-ups. He has like a really cool and interesting neutral, but it's not. It, it's just not good enough right now. I don't know. Oh. I'm not Charizard. Man. Caught him with the lion, though. Thundercats. No, 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 no. You don't. That's what's so dumb about this character. It's like. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's like, oh, I made a mistake. I'm going to fall to my. Never mind. I'm up here. What's good? How are you doing? Yep. It's. Ah, uh, no. Oh, you got him again. Positioning. No, not going to get it. Roy, if Roy's up me wasn't so good, he would be so super duper dead <laughs> all the time. <laughs> Yeah, Roy's up B is ridiculously mad. Roy's up B, whenever it's two spots, reaches huh. barely over the ledge. So if you like try to try to counter cancel it and like detail with it with any character, you just can't. Really? Yeah. That's pretty jank. Yeah, it's it's pretty lame. Okay, I gotta play. That was right, nice man. Good stuff, homie. That is the third member of the Brown Battalion. Oh, I caught it. I'm that next level, homie. 
Oh, yes, he's about to play Genosis. He, he might get bopped. We'll see. All I right. have my man flashing fire here. How's it going, guys? I'm Woo! back. I'm back in action. You got a mean snake. I saw that. <laughs> yeah. Hamlin kind of bopped me, though. It's okay. Yeah. Hamlin's bad. He I just mean, had a good lucky time. No, he was smart. He used the needles, and it was like really hard to do anything because as soon as I got hit by the needles, I got grabbed. And then as soon as I got grabbed, I was like, Umbreon, off stage. Umbreon texted me and told me to tell uh, Hamlin that he's playing like a complete scumbag. Yeah. <laughs> and he was so proud. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know. Play the matchup, right? What are you gonna do? Yeah, exactly, man. All right. Meantime, uh, speaking of matchups, this is definitely not. Oh, okay. I was about to say this isn't a very good Off matchup for Roy, top, but, but Sethlon makes it look easy. Sethlon being Sethlon, man. He, but he played it right. He played it proper. Like he sat there, moved less. You know, he played good footsies, and his spacing was real proper. Because as I was explaining the stream, it's like this is the equivalent of playing against Geef. You have to be real, right, on point with your footsies. Don't get grabbed because you are going to get wrecked yep. very quickly. And Roy struggles against these fattier uh, kind of characters. That fattier? Are good, these fattier kind of characters. Fattier. Hashtag fattier. Hashtag fattier. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, DDD, he's, he's had a healthy a healthy lifestyle. You know, yep. he's, he's large. He's in charge. And he's having fun. Look how much he's smiling. Like, have you ever seen DDD, like, not smile? No, never, man. He's got also an army of Gordos at his uh, disposal. Like, just chuck those things out. Yep. So All key, those waddle -dees. Yeah, the key here is to keep DDD in the air because DDD's charge cancel is significant and his guard range is massive. Like, probably the best in the game, yeah, if I remember correctly. Yeah, Hamlin just said it, well, confirmed it was. Yeah, and so basically, when DDD's off the ground, you remove those two gigantic options that are really kind of a bane with Roy. Ooh, the DAC has, does it raw and. Check nope. that out. Enough smash kill off the top and the balloon kill the boot. Uh, in Oklahoma, we're all about that balloon. Oh, yeah. We're getting there, too, homie. <laughs> but good drop down fair. What he you're seeing is spot on spacing from Sethlon, but he's also trying to see if he can get those cross ups to get the grab position and also using those forward tilts that are a disjointed hitbox. Yeah, yeah, he's done. That kind of come out there, control that distance between the two. And hey, it's a good tool. 1 1 in the balloon battle. Yes. Yeah, yeah, Seth one's up one game. I, yep. Okay. Oh, he tries to wave dash back and get that forward smash. It's going to come down to really minute movements. Smart stuff by Birdman, recognizing that Seth had some pretty options out of shield and just said, nope, I'm not going to deal with your shield. I'm just going to follow you. Oh, Birdman seeing if he can get back on. Oh, oh, no. He tried to get the second half, which kind of. Oh, <laughs> been an, oh my gosh. I love it. That was such a gamble. I love it. I was trying to use that forward tilt. Yeah, that forward tilt has like the best range of any normal move in the game, I'm pretty sure. And it's pretty active too. You have because of the time that it's rotating out there. Yep. It is very active. Okay, so he's gonna get back on. Yeah, forward tilt coming in action once again. That wall is man. Scary business. Because you can use that for all that extra movement at neutral. He's gonna see oh down tilt there. He right. tries to go for the cross of a good get up attack yep. from uh, Birdman. Yep, nice and delayed. Waits till Sethon commits to the double jump. Oh, missed it. Good back dash. Oh, oh my gosh! My God. <laughs> that is what you don't want to do against Roy. Because yep. Roy is different than Marth, right? Because he Marth has a fixed, uh, like fixed knockback. A yes. fixed knockback, or at versus, least fixed percent. Versus Roy, who has it's like 1.23. Yeah, 1 the, the damage and knockback scaling is something like 50% extra. It's it's really scary. And when you get a charge forward smash from the King DDD himself. That hammer is becoming his own demise as he just gets. Oh, oh again! Oh, 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 he had another chance. He could have just did. dropped down and done it. He did, but he, he he went in the air like a little. Seth Lund's going for the footstool, I can tell. Oh yeah, <laughs> he's going for the style because these two are homies. I mean, these guys play consistently, and oh, stabs him. It's not going to be enough though. Not quite, because he is one fattier penguin. Yes. Wow. That's going to be enough. Okay, that is scarier than it looks because Seth has a time that right at the apex of the, the up B when there's no hitbox coming down. Yes. Yeah. He knows that back air hitbox really well. It hits slightly more above than Roy than you might expect. That's his bread and butter, man. Yep. He has to know that thing inside and out. And once again, Seth defeating the matchup and defeating Birdman 2-0. Clean. Good stuff. And ooh, okay. I'm I'm really excited about this. This is Gnosis versus Ham Yojo. Yes. Um, Gnosis currently the best project and player in Oklahoma. Ooh, uh, really? Yeah, because you know Jay Z uh, is in Michigan now, mm. and since Jay Z is not here, mm -hmm. uh, 
Gnosis has been taking like literally every single tournament that he's gone to. In really? Ball. Yes. I've I've done the PR. I he's won everything that he's entered. That's nuts. Yep. That um, is insane. Jay Z, hurry up, come back. <laughs> we need you, homie. Yeah. And Balance so things out. I want to see that Ivysaur again. He was doing it with Mario uh, prior to um, Aftershock. Yep. And he, I talked to him recently. He said he wanted he was switching to Marth and Toon Link primarily. Why? He's always had a Toon Link. I I don't know. Like I honestly don't. Uh, he, he said okay. that Mario was like too easy. Uh, That's so, so take with it, take from that what you will. I, I'm not gonna comment further on that. But regardless, <laughs> I'm curious to see what character he actually goes for because he actually just plays like freaking everyone and he's a beast. I mean, a lot of these top players do. Like I can I can play against Cephalon. Like he and I run sets and. Yeah. It's like those moments where it's like, I know you're going to bop me. It's a question of how badly you bop me. Yeah. So I'm going to say, okay, I'm going to play Marth, and you're going to play Mario, and I'm going to try to survive. <laughs> so I, a lot of these top players, they, they know those, the, at least the bare minimum when it comes to the characters, at least what they want. Yeah, they're familiar the with how the character works, what kind of combos they yeah. want, you know, the matchups.